Welcome again to another edition of Girls Inc. at Home. My name is Ivana and I'm coming to you with another video. Uh, for today's video, we're going to touch base a little bit on the subject that we did on Tuesday on oxidation, but this time we're going to use kind of the same ingredients but in a completely different way. We're going to help a penny recover and look shiny and new. So stay tuned for our next um, for the next clip and for our next videos. Um, Fridays, there's going to be a really cool video posted, um, so make sure you stay tuned for that one. Thank you. So for today's project, we're going to need a penny. Um, this penny is probably really, really old, from 1975, and so it has been oxidized. And so what that means is that it has this dark layer of like dark greenish, it's called patina. And um, we're gonna try to clean this off and make our penny brand new and shiny. So we have a penny. We need a teaspoon or a little spoon, whatever you have. Some lemon, I already have one cut up. Salt, we need a paper towel to remove it, and a little bowl. So I'm going to use my bowl and squeeze some lemon inside of it. I'm going to squeeze enough so that the penny is covered completely by it. So you don't need too, too much since the pennies are pretty thin, so I'm gonna do that. And then we're going to add our penny right here and we're going to let it sit there for a while and see if this citric acid or the lemon juice um, is able to remove that layer. So it kind of is working like iron that has that rust and that's kind of what this patina or this layer on the copper has done. And so this citric acid is supposed to kind of break down those layers or break down that um, oxidation and make it clear again. So what you can also do to kind of help out the process is you can add some salt and only a little bit and mix it in there with the lemon juice. And this is going to kind of help break down these um, little molecules in here so that it can be faster to break them down. All right, so I would say that you can let this sit there for about five, 10 minutes, depending on um, how much time you want it to sit there for, but the longer it sits there, the easier it's going to be to remove that layer once you clean it off. Um, some, of other some other things that you have at home that you can use to help that process could be salsa um, this has vinegar I didn't have like pure vinegar but this has vinegar and you can also try adding it to your lemon juice to see if that would help it break down and clear that off faster and like any good camera person or show I already have a few that I've tried so I put these about 10 minutes ago this one has the salt and this one was just the lemon juice on its own and as you can tell it started off super um, oxidized with a big layer of that uh, dark greenish on here and now we see that if we really remove this and clean it up it is nicely shiny once again right there and then we're gonna check the one with the salt the salt one started off really strong it looked like it was going to do it and it looked like it was removing everything but I think at some point it kind of stopped because it didn't remove it as well I don't know if the salt had anything to do with that it still helped but it didn't do it as clear as this one right here and so again you can try this with other things at your home you can add a little sauce maybe you have something else in your pantry that has vinegar and see if you can clean up some pennies maybe try it with different coins who knows all right thanks for watching